Today we're giving out this book. We're standing out here on Coney Island Avenue and we have a little paperback furnished by Saturate New York. It's a book by John Burke called Imagine Heaven. And we're distributing this because many people have had near-death experiences. And God forbid if you should die right now, you might be right down here on, this, on the sidewalk, but you would not be on the sidewalk. You would be above yourself looking down wondering who is that person and at this point you would not know that you were dead and you would not know that even though you have no body you're still very much self-conscious as a spirit and then usually there's two or three things that happen these are reported by doctors cardiologists psychiatrists people who have no reason to lie and who would be hurt as far as their personal reputation in the medical field is concerned if they were telling a yarn or a tall tale. They say they're aware of a boundary. If they go beyond that boundary, there's no returning. They are also aware of a luminous being and they know intuitively that it is Yeshua HaMashiach and they are in his presence and they are experiencing the serenity and the glorious peace of the Prince of Peace and then realizing that if they go beyond this certain barrier they can't come back and realizing that there's something else they have to do they and they describe this many of them as something like being on a roller coaster and going backwards and falling with a great thud back into your body and when this happens they open their eyes and the paramedics and the doctors and the surgeons are there smiling because their near-death experience where they experienced the stoppage of the heart, the stoppage of the breathing, and the brain dead ending of the brain is only a near-death experience. They do not uh, terminally die they are brought back because of the advanced resuscitation medical treatment that we have one out of 25 Americans will experience a near-death experience as a matter of fact most people try to get a living will because they know that there's a very good possibility they will be resuscitated and they want to be able to tell their loved ones what to do if they are resuscitated or they could be resuscitated if they don't want to be resuscitated. So we're out here at 1410 Coney Island Avenue between J and K in Midwood. Just take the subway down to Avenue J, walk over five blocks to Coney Island Avenue turn left and we're between Coney Island, uh, J and K on Coney Island Avenue, 1410. We have a service every Sunday at one o'clock and right now we're doing an open air service and distributing these books and God bless you.